Sorry, John, no time for toast, because for once, this celebrity has decided to be punctual. John! Oh, my God, <laughs> can you bow? I, I, I had no clue. Oh God, I'm so thrilled. Thank God. <laughs> Thank God. I thought it was going to be some easy. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Lord Jesus. A huge wave of relief and a semi-erection, which I, I wasn't, I really wasn't ready for. Where are we going and what are you taking me there for? Well, you always thought that my world is, <laughs> well, silly. But I'd yes. like you to see how, how much work goes into just a small little picture. I'm a bit concerned about this building. Where, what is this? This is People magazine. Really? We're having a shoot. <laughs> Which I've carefully avoided for most of my life. In fact, one of my guiding principles was never be in People magazine. So this is People? Yes, yes. SA's most popular gossip mag. Gossip. Yes. You, you know me so well. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Let's get started. Great. I did get a kick up taking him to People magazine. Number one, he hates gossip. He hates crass media and materialism and all of that. Can you inject little bits of baby? serum into my face. So taking him into that space was really nice because I know that he hated it, but he had to be polite to me. I'm not sure, but I think I may be getting an erection. That's the second time John's erection has uh, <clears throat> come up. Is he hotter for tabloids than he lets on? Yes. This? Yes. Ringmaster, yes. chaos, mayhem yes. and perversion. Yeah. Yes. Is it okay if my jocks are sticking out? Cause yes, it's actually very sexy. Is that good? Yes, okay. it's like very now. Check out my rods. Mm. No, yeah. but... What? I, OK, clearly I need to um, give you the rules. Man. Right. They are rules. OK. So the three Ps. Very simple. Three Ps? Yes. So okay. step one, I want you to pout for me. What am I thinking when I, as I'm like... You're I'm, thinking, like I'm, um, I'm, I'm the dumb. artist thing. Oh. I love my jacket. Look I love at my me. jacket. Yes. Is that a pout? It looked more like a chicken's asshole. <laughs> Number two, yep. you pose. So okay. if I had to do it, it would be... And that's like vulnerable, I'm yes, almost I'm naked feeling, under my I'm coat. Feeling. Good luck for getting this image of John thinking about being naked under his jacket. Oh, I'm still not sure his pout is up to standard, though. Every click is a different pose. Every click? Every click, you're, just, you're selling the interesting parts of your body. Right. Yes. Wow. Yeah. Had a lot to work with there. That's pouting yes. and... And posing. And, and posing. Yes, and now we do the posterior. My three Ps are photo shoot, People magazine, puss of yourself. He's not even on Instagram to take pictures. He'd rather take a picture of his daughter or a tree. And here I am taking pictures of him and asking him to pout and pose and show his dairy on. It was amazing. Now we take the picture for the cover. Have we not done it yet? No, oh, yeah. that was practice. I thought we had the cover. No, we don't. So what are your famous last words? Famous last words yes. before I go on the cover of People magazine is, I'm sorry, Mom, um, and I promise to make it up to you. OK, cool. Let's bring in the snake. So what? I fucking hate snakes. Wait. Where did badass John Flismus go? Okay, that is a fucking huge snake. You no, that is, and it, look how it's gripping his leg. That is a fucking, it's, a, it's trying to eat the man. <laughs> it's trying no, to I eat can't, the man. I can't, I can't. It's trying to eat I the can't, man. I can't, I can't do that. That's the first thing. It's an albino, which means bad luck. And thirdly, he's wide fucking awake. No fucking way. Wait, no. Oh, that's a big You're snake. It. He's just a baby. <laughs> it's a baby. It's not a fucking eats babies. Jesus Christ, here we go. This is not. Oh no. <laughs> Quick, take the you fucking thing. I'm just too full his head there. The snake that weighs the same as me on me. There's a bead of sweat on my anus cheeks at the top, right? <laughs> I was like carrying myself, but every. every ounce that I was carrying was a fucking part of a snake. Oh, oh it's moving. Oh my God, it's it moving moves. on his body. Oh, <laughs> Jesus, take the fucking picture. And Kanye fucked off the other way. She didn't even stick around for that. I thought we were partners in this fucking thing. When we do the comedy, don't waste energy on being afraid of the comedy. Just fucking block that out. Easier said than done, John. Because also comedy is going to be about truth. That's what we're going to do, because we're going to win truth. this fucking thing. So if all the other awesome. comedians, fuck you and your celebrities. <laughs> fuck you guys. Comedy is not about talking. It's about listening. You, you listen to people. And you'll find in this time now, hopefully, everything you do between now and when we do the show, you're going to listen to people slightly differently. Yeah, you never 
want to say something that you're afraid of saying or you regret saying. Yes. It makes you look weak. Maybe we start with three sections and we'll, we'll just put more and more jokes into each section. We're going to write 10 or 12 and then we're going to cut down to what the very best of it is. A big problem is people stretch out a shit joke for too long. You want the shortest distance between the start and the punchline. Come on, John. Kanye's not one to cut corners. So that's a very strong start because what you're doing is you're just dropping a bomb. I'm fucking white and my hair's even Indian. <laughs> you go, basically, I've gripped it myself. I'm probably not going to do anything that he told me. I'm just going to remember my lines and deliver them the best way I can. The night of Kanye's stand-up set is here, and our duo are right on time. Or at least John is. It's the one rule of comedy, you have to actually show up. Fear not, John. Kanye is just fashionably late. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> you have to show up. It's the I one know, rule I of comedy. To. I'd never leave. I know you're matching. I'd never leave. But you know, I mean I'm very concerned. Do you get well it? Done. Do you see it? Do you see it? Do you see it? Do you see it? How's the set? Are you do you have it? No, what I was on mean? set the whole day. No, but last night, homework, when you went home to, before your big shoot day, did I you looked at it something? and I got claustrophobic and I put it down. We have to beat everyone today. I know. You have to fucking, you've got to kill tonight. I know. You've got to, now it's showtime. Remember when the mm -hmm. snake was about to fucking arrive? Yes. It's your snake time. So what are your famous last words? Fucking hell. <laughs> That's my girl, fucking hell. Okay, good, let's go. So give him a big round of applause for the wonderful world of comedy. No, I know you're wondering. My name is Kanye Seal. It means the light. Do you get it? So I am lighter. And trust me, um, if I do another treatment, I think I'll be transparent. I'll haunt myself. But we do need transparency in this country, don't you think? I'm serious. I mean, my skin is lighter, my hair is Indian, so I think I've gooped myself. <laughs> yes, you see, a real laugh. I'm starting to get Caucasian thoughts. <laughs> Things like, if the sun is so bright, then why is it so dark in space? <laughs> I think she's getting big laughs. On a lighter note, you know, when I think black, it's not that bad in South Africa. I mean, everyone is like, what about white people trying to conform and, and understand our culture? Well, listen, black people, I'm in the system. I'm fighting within the system. They like me. <laughs> That's how you get your land back. <laughs> so now that my life has changed, if you don't know me, Google me. Um, if you don't know my history, I've really come a long way. I'm proud of myself. And now that they're now starting to call me actress, the classy mom, um, the non-socialite anymore. Um, I started wondering, why don't I get any sponsors, you know, like maybe face of Revlon or a face of Maybelline, a sponsor that goes with my life. So I tweeted this the other day and then Omo Bleach called me. <laughs> my name is Kanye Mba, I'm not a comedian, but I am in transition, as you can see. My days have been darker. But things are getting lighter, I must say, and it's getting better. And you know, they say in every dark tunnel there is a light. Thank you very much.